Hey guys in this video I'm going to walk you through on how I make and plan my text-to-speech videos on the channel, also I made a video a month ago on how to start a text-to-speech channel, so if you haven't created one, do check out that video after watching this to help guide you on how and what you need to start one. So the first step I take before making any video is to think of a topic that I want to make a YouTube video on, so as a beginner you might have one or two ideas that you came up with and sometimes you might not even have an idea on what video you should make. The first thing to do when you stuck is to check out video ideas on your niche, like if your channel is going to be around video games, you should make videos that revolves around gaming, like making videos on the latest games for the year or basically playing the games yourself to show the viewers the look and feel of the game and also check out what kind of content other YouTubers in your niche are making. So as a beginner I advise, you make use of Google and YouTube, because they serve as a great place to get video ideas for your channel, and also to do in-depth research on topics, on what you should add and things other creators missed out on that topic. As a beginner I recommend you try TubeBuddy. TubeBuddy is a browser plugin that helps you on what topics you should go for or not, which is possible using the keyword research tool, which you can also get access to for free using the link in the description below. I encourage you to do your keyword research to know if that topic is worth targeting or not, before doing your research and scripting. Next is scripting your video. This can be quite troublesome for a lot of beginners out there, so what I advise you to do as a beginner attempting to script his or her first video, is to think of it in three steps. When I script my video I split it up into the introduction, where I introduce the topic for the video, myself and other formalities, then I move straight into the body of the video so the body contains all the vital informations you have gathered through your research, and it should be structured in such a way that viewers can understand your message that you are trying to pass to them. So how you structure your body content matters a lot, and it comes down to your scripting, so don't pressure yourself, just script your video like how you would actually have spoken it. So when you are done with the body, the next will be your outro. So your outro is where you conclude the video and give a preview of the important aspect you covered in the video, and with other recommendation you want to share with your viewers. Do note, when scripting your video, avoid using lots of grammars to avoid confusions, because you don't want your video to be like a dictionary. Right. So when you are done scripting your video, you should always proofread your script for any mistake you made in your script, like spelling errors, because this might affect the next step we are about to take. So the next step is to convert our script into a voiceover using an AI text-to-speech software, have recommend a quite number of text-to-speech software that are great for YouTube videos, so you can try out Speechalo, Muff or Mike Monster, the link will be in the description below. So I'm gonna be using Mike Monster for this video, so if you want to use Mike Monster it costs just $37 for a lifetime access, so to create our text-to-speech, you have to go to the Mike Monster dashboard and create a new project, after that you will direct it into the Mike Monster basic editor, so what you simply have to do is to copy your script and paste it into the Mike Monster editor and choose what voice you want to use, I'm gonna go with USA Floki, and I'm gonna tweak the pitch and convert the script into a voiceover and download it into my phone or my computer, if you want to watch the full Mike Monster tutorial, check the card above or the description below. So the next step I take is to get clips and images that I want to use for my video, I grab free videos and images from sites like Pexels, Pixabay etc. and use them in my YouTube videos without copyright strikes. So now comes one of the most important part of this video. In this step, our job is to piece everything we have been doing into one, we do that through editing. So in this step we make use of a video editor to edit our videos, and the one I currently use to edit my YouTube videos is called Filmora, so I recommend you check it out. I will leave a link to a free trail of Filmora in the description below and also I'm gonna leave a tutorial I made recently on how to edit videos with Filmora in the description below, so that video will progress you through as a beginner on how to edit your videos. So this is basically how I plan and make my text-to-speech videos for YouTube. So just to run through what we did, we talked on how to find videos ideas, how to do keyword research, how to research on video topics with the aid of Google and YouTube. We also talked about how to script your videos, how to find free videos and images, how to convert your script into a voiceover and finally how to edit your videos. So I hope this video showed you more insight on how I make my videos, and will also guide you on how to make your own text-to-speech videos online. So that wraps up for today's video, 
check the description for more infos, and do watch any of my videos displaying on the screen right now, and we will see in the next video. Bye.